for tipping me off. It was the push I needed. I've been grappling with what to do for a long time. If I'd had someone like you around, I might have made the right decision in the first place. I bet I'd be walking a very different path right now. Lester would sure be different. Maybe even all of Fodlan would be different. I think you're giving me too much credit. I don't know. I'm a pretty good judge of character. But anyway, if you don't have anything else lined up after the war, why not come with me? I think we make a pretty good team. Yeah, maybe we do. I'll give it some thought. That's all I can ask. But for now, I guess you know what to do next. Everyone, lend me your ears. Soon we will arrive in the Valley of Torment, where our Imperial allies will fight for supremacy against the forces of the Kingdom and Central Church. This is certain to be a violent and bloody battle. Death will indeed feast well this day. So think long and hard. Is this what you want? Yes, we signed a pact with the Empire, but only under duress after they overran our lands. And what was the other option? To side with the corrupt church and the kingdom they cling to? Never. A false choice is no choice at all. But now, right here and now, the Leicester Alliance has a chance to turn the tables. <laughs> Loyal friends, brave allies, fellow visionaries. Will we accept an emperor who pays for her needless wars in the coin of our blood? Will we submit to an archbishop and a king who would shackle us to their outmoded customs? I say no. I say never. And this day, on this battlefield, we stake a claim to a future of our own making. This day, we help these monsters destroy themselves and claim this world for our own. This day, we declare war against the Empire and the Kingdom. I take it you heard the ill news, Your Majesty? Moments ago, yes. I don't get it. Why would the Alliance want to make enemies of both the Empire and the Kingdom? It doesn't make any sense. I underestimated you, Claude. the Alliance, the Kingdom, even the forces of the Church. To think we would all meet in such a cramped locale. Hold on. Does anyone actually see the Knights of Seros amidst all this? I wonder if they're not even here to begin with. We strike at the Imperial Army today. Do not let the Alliance distract you. Yes, as you command. The party's already starting, huh? It's too bad we couldn't throw it for something a little more civilized. Would it kill you to be serious for once, Claude? For the last time, Flane, I am against this. It is not too late to retreat. And for the last time, I intend to fight! Besides, it would seem the battle is about to begin. Well then, just give the command, Edelgard. Good. Our very hope depends on you. Brave warriors of Adrestia, the time has come to demonstrate the Empire's valor, to prove our supremacy. Any who dare stand in our way must be cut down. Now! As one, attack! Claude, 
God clearly wants us to deal with the kingdom and the church ourselves, so that he can profit from the fallout. Yes. It would appear someone has let our plans slip. The enemy knew precisely how to box us in. This is a shame, Claude. I thought we'd finally forged a path to true friendship. What can I say? I've got big dreams, same as you. Plus, I think we both knew this was going to happen eventually. Edelgard's lucky to have someone like you on her side. I envy her. You'd be right here with us if you didn't decide to stab her in the back. It was a good strategy, but not good enough. And now, look what I've done to all of you. It's not what you wanted, but the world won't forget your ambition, because it will live on through me.